I'm always amazed at, at how you're moving ahead to find a new and better way to get the average person involved in ministry. You know, up till now, the church was always built around a certain leadership group. But most of us were excluded. We could come and listen. We could give money. But generally beyond that, we weren't qualified. And you started a whole new revolution of saying, you are all qualified. You can all be this. You can all build a church. You can all become a pastor. You, you all have leadership ability. Mm -hmm. When I went to Christian high school, a pastor said to me that I had talents for leadership in God's kingdom. But you see, at the same time, I, I didn't go to college, so I was not considered smart enough. See, you have developed the concept that you're all smart enough. God gave you the brain power to do the fundamental act of ministry. Bring others in. Preaching is not the fundamental act, but who are you going to preach to <laughs> if you haven't witnessed anybody? And so you are teaching all of us to be more effective witnesses and empowering the average person who doesn't have a sophisticated education to build his own church. I often think back to my life, and I thought when I early days, I thought, uh, see, I didn't go to college. I didn't have a good education. But I thought, I really could have been a minister. People mm -hmm. have said to me, you really could have been a minister. I said, yeah, but I wasn't smart enough. <laughs> see, I didn't go to college. Right. So I excluded myself from that field. And a lot of you have excluded yourself from ministry because you didn't think you were qualified. You didn't have the education. You didn't have the background. You didn't have the money. And now here this comes along. I said, we don't care about all that. You can start, not only can you, st we're going to teach you how to become a pastor, we're going to start you, show you how to start the church. Yep. You're not going to wait for a calling to some church or some denomination. You're going to start your own church. You're going to bring people in and build a church from scratch, which is what the Christianity from old days was all about. Yeah. That's how we became a worldwide uh, uh, religious organization, by, by regular people sharing the gospel. And that's what you do. And so for all of you who are thinking about this, just remember, forget whether you're qualified. You are qualified. You know why? Because God laid it on you to want to become a pastor. Now, we, you can talk about being a lay pastor or an or a ordained pastor, but who don't, let, let's just don't get hung up on the details. You want to be a pastor? We're going to teach you how to be a pastor, how to start a church, and then... Follow that on with how to help you advance your church and advance your knowledge so that you can become more knowledgeable and more effective and reach more people so you can build more and more churches.